Welcome back to my kitchen. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make a honey glazed shrimp sheet pan dinner. This is one of my favorite sheet pan dinners. There's minimal cleanup because you're only using a sheet pan to cook everything. And it's ready in just a little over 30 minutes. The sweet marinade on the shrimp with tender roasted vegetables is such a flavorful and satisfying combination. I know you're gonna love it too, so keep watching. I found all of these wholesome ingredients at Basil Bandwagon Natural Market. We're gonna use vegetables that are perfect for roasting and complement the texture of shrimp. Veggies like these little cipollini onions, delicata squash, and red kabocha squash are so tasty. Now hold up if you're saying to yourself, Christine, I've never even heard of these vegetables or seen these vegetables at my local grocery store. No worries. Like most of my recipes, this is adaptable. If you can't find this kind of squash, just use some butternut squash instead. All right, so let's get started cooking. First, we're gonna make the marinade. In a medium mixing bowl, whisk together one third cup of honey. I'm using raw honey, but you can use regular honey. I'm adding a quarter cup of coconut aminos, which tastes very similar to soy sauce, but it's soy free. Then I'm gonna add one half teaspoon of onion powder and sea salt and white pepper to taste. We're gonna use half of this marinade to marinate the shrimp and save the other half for cooking the shrimp. So you'll have about a half cup of marinade. I'm pouring a quarter cup of that into my little glass jar. <laughs> I'm using medium sized shrimp. This is the Henry and Lisa's brand. It was frozen and they're already peeled with the tail on. I'm going to use a quick thawing method by placing them in a colander and letting cold water run over them for six to seven minutes. Personally, I like to dry off the shrimp so that they absorb even more of the marinade. Now we're ready to marinate the shrimp. Place the shrimp in a medium sized glass bowl. Add half of the marinade and toss well to combine. Cover the bowl and place it in the refrigerator for at least 15 minutes. To make the shrimp even more flavorful, you can marinate them up to eight hours or overnight. We're going to pour the rest of the marinade into a glass jar and refrigerate it. Next, we're gonna season and roast roughly two pounds of vegetables of your choice. In my case, I'm gonna use two cipollini onions sliced into onion rings. And now I'm gonna cut the red cipollini onion the same way, as soon as I get over crying with these tears. <laughs> Four ounces of creamy mushrooms sliced in half. One half of a medium-sized celery root that's peeled and diced. One small turnip peeled and diced. one cup of zucchini sliced into bite-sized pieces. This is like the jewelry of the plant world. It's so cute, right? One to two small patty pan squashes sliced and one cup of diced winter squash, which includes red kabocha squash, delicata squash, and honey nut squash. Now that our shrimp is done marinating, I'm preheating my oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Line a large rimmed baking sheet with parchment paper. This makes for easy cleanup. Add 
the vegetables to the baking sheet and toss with one to two tablespoons of refined coconut oil. Or feel free to use melted ghee, tallow, or olive oil if you prefer. Season the vegetables with sea salt and white pepper to taste and toss again. Arrange the vegetables in a single layer. Roast for 15 minutes. And we're just gonna let those cook for 15 minutes before flipping them over. While I'm waiting for the veggies to roast, I'm gonna go ahead and prep my garnishes. So I'm chopping up some washed cilantro. I'm gonna cut some lemon wedges. Then remove the sheet pan from the oven. Flip the vegetables over, return them to the oven and roast for 15 more minutes. Now it's time to add the shrimp. Remove the baking sheet from the oven. Use a spatula or tongs to carefully move the vegetables over to one side to make room for the shrimp. Add the shrimp to the baking sheet, discarding the used marinade. Drizzle the shrimp with the remaining unused marinade that was in the jar. Return the baking sheet to the oven and bake for five to seven minutes or until the shrimp are pink and firm to the touch. This is looking nice and pink and it's firm to the touch, so that's perfect. And of course you want your vegetables to get nice and fork tender. Nice and fork tender. I'm sure nice and hot. Mmm, <laughs> so good. And of course you can toss that extra marinade that's on the pan with the vegetables just to add nice flavor. Serve the roasted vegetables and shrimp garnished with the cilantro. This goes really well with some fluffy cooked white rice. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make this honey glazed shrimp sheet pan dinner. Let me know in the comments, what's your favorite way to prepare shrimp? A big thank you to Basil Bandwagon Natural Market for providing the ingredients in today's video. And if you're in New Jersey, be sure to check out their free rewards program, which helps you save money on groceries every trip. Thanks for watching and see you the next time.